we started out with Class C motorhome and we took a winter trip, maybe two weeks, like three weeks. In a we would go away for the winter for three weeks, then three months, and then we decided to sell the farm and we sold our house, we moved out, children lived there for a short time while we were gone in the winter and now we own it, what we live in, which is our fifth wheel. We put everything out that we didn't take with us here in the rooms. Children put their name in a bowl and they went through and had six things on their list that each six wanted to have in their home and as their name got out they chose what they wanted. Our whole possessions are in our children's home. When we go to the children's house, everything we own from pictures to a vase to silverware to dishes, to furniture, antique, whatever they just is in our children's home. And as we go see them, it's there. We spend six months here in Arizona, and then we go back to Minnesota for six months. And our son owns a campground at a, on a lake north of the Twin Cities. And we stay there and help him with the groundskeeping, meeting people. We take care of the RV park there. Here in the desert, you would think, I'm all alone. You're really not. Because you can go out to eat, you can visit. Campfires are very popular here. And um, there's days where you have to write on the calendar. Do you think, what am I going to do tomorrow? Before you can turn around, <laughs> your week is full. <laughs> Once a week, I do my chores. I dump the tanks and haul them away and then bring fresh water back. And that's so once a week I do my chores and that's it. This particular area is the only one like it in the United States. And we have a short term, which is $25 for 14 days, or 125 which runs from um, September 15th to April 15th. And there are seven different like sister parks that you can camp in that. And that includes um, dumping your RV tanks, taking on fresh water, and garbage disposal. In the outlying areas of this area, right around Quartzsite, we do have um, five different areas that are free for 14 days. They don't come with any kind of uh, amenities at all. You have to find your garbage and pack in what you pack out. Oh, you can do as much as you want out here or as little as you want. It's, it's great. You can do... You have no set thing to do. Yep, no, you follow the, follow the sun. That's that's about what it is, and I guess you get spoiled, and you can spoil yourself as much as you want. But uh, the warmth, y your body becomes climatized. So, um, which I think probably ninety percent of full time people follow the sun. Mm -hmm. um, I had once made the statement to Jim that he would never catch me living in this godforsaken desert because it's dustier here than it was in the park. We came last year in a smaller unit and introdu he introduced us to the solar panels where I had electricity when I wanted it, um, the generator on cloudy days when we needed it, and here I am and I love it and I'll do it again. So this is a good life. Mm -hmm. For us it is.